How many of you guys don't get to see your family enough? Raise your hand. Yeah, it's f-ing you. Here's the deal. Guess what? You're never gonna f-ing see them. Kiss them goodbye until you build a sales team. Hey guys, what's up, man? How you guys feeling today? Listen, so here's my goal. Everybody remember this. It's 11.04. I'm gonna be done at 11.14. Is that cool? You guys are busy. So I'm gonna give you, listen, if you can't pay attention for 10 minutes, you're gonna f-ing lose your life. And you say, Andy, why would I? Well, number one, let's start out with the meeting for the first 30 seconds. My wife came to me when I was killing it. I was making 2.5 million as a GM. Okay, I took a store from selling 100 a month to 500. She says, Andy, I've learned to live without you. I've learned to live without you. Look, you guys want to kiss your kids and your wife goodbye? How many of you guys don't get to see your family enough? Raise your hand. Yeah, it's f-ing you. Here's the deal. Guess what? You're never going to see them. Kiss them goodbye until you build a sales team. I'm going to ask one question. Is your team better than you? They f-ing should be. Your team should f-ing be better than you. If you were any sort of leader, your team would be better than you. But you guys f-ing run around like you're the best f-ing thing in the world. You're hot. F-ing. You close every f-ing deal. Well, good job. You never get to f-ing leave now, dumb. <laughs> <laughs> stupid is that? You guys will listen to me for a minute, okay? Your team, it's called human capital. Write it down. Two words, human capital. That's what you guys have to work with, okay? You guys get the ability to take underdogs, to take whoever it is that you have on your floor that you believe is going to make a great sales pro, man or woman, woman, it doesn't matter. And you got the ability to recreate them and to make them better than you. And if you're a great leader, you'll do that. But listen, it won't happen unless it's the most important thing to you. Okay, so let's talk about priorities real quick. Priority number one, building your sales team is your number one priority in life. That's it. Not having more people, but having great people. And by the way, who gets to set the standard for those people? You do. I'm gonna ask you a question, your attitude, your work ethic, the way that you do everything, your habits, okay? Is that the standard you're setting for them? Are you the example? Would you say I am the example that I would like for all my guys to follow? Because I think some of you guys are maybe some examples. And you may not like to hear that. The first place to start is going and looking in the damn mirror. You want to see how great you can become? Go own your Hey, you know what? I need to quit doing this. You know what? I need to, when I get to work, instead of going and sitting down at my desk, I need to go shake everybody's hand in the store and tell them how much I appreciate them. Love you guys. I'm glad you're here. It means everything to me that, that we've got this team together. By the way, let's have a meeting together, guys. Let's go. Look, guys, I'm going to tell you this right now. We are going to the top. We're going to do it together. I am by your side. I'm not in front of you. I'm not behind you. As a leader, we lead 360, front, back, sides. Everything we do, they're watching. Don't forget that. Most of the time, one of the reasons why you miss your great life is because, dude, you weren't the example for them. Now, listen to me. I've created a sales training program. I'm not just here to teach you guys how to close the deal. What I want to teach them is how to be better people. I want to teach them how to be more loyal to you. Guys, I want you to have an unrecruitable sales team. Unrecruitable. Like somebody could call them and be like, dude, I'll give you 10 grand more to come across the street and work for me. I'm like, fuck you, dude. I'm staying with Bruce till I die. That's what I want. That's all I want, okay? And by the way, I'm gonna say something to you. Your people, honestly, at the end of the day, if all you do is go around and tell them how much money they can make with you, the only thing they can give about is money. You created this problem. You did it. You know what you should be telling them every day? I don't care how much money I weigh, no matter how much money I make. I want to work around people that believe what I believe and I believe what they believe. And I want to work around people that are like me. Look, you guys could be anywhere in the world right now. Doesn't it feel good to know you're in the right place? Somebody that loves you, cares about your family and wants to make sure that you have a great life. Yes. And by the way, if we make a bunch of money, that's just a bonus, isn't it? See, you guys talk about money forever. When somebody offers a little more money, you're the one that trained them to go get it. You're training your guys to be recruitable. Knock it off. 
And I'm gonna finish with one last thing because I said I'd be done, right? I'm gonna move quick. I don't wanna give you so much you can't remember what I said. I'm gonna finish with one last thing. If I, by the way, listen to me, this is where a leader really is a real leader. If I paged all your guys in the room right now, every one of them, all your salespeople, internet, BDC, sales, I don't care who they are. And I said, hey guys, look, as the leadership, we would like to know who are your mentors. Who do you look up to? See, because we want to go look them up tonight. We'd like to study who you want to be like. So here's a pen. Here's a piece of paper. Write down, don't have to put your name on it, but write down the name of your mentor on this piece of paper. Fold it in half and hand it to me as you walk out the door. So they all leave, right? And we put these pieces of paper in the middle of the room and we unfold them. And what we realize is our name isn't on any of those pieces of paper. You know why? Because they don't want to be like us. They don't look up to us. You're a desk guy. Dude, I'm telling you, no ways. We can change this today. How do we change it? Number one, an individual can be beat, but a team can't be beat. Listen to me. You guys got to come together. Three stores, one store. You got to operate, run as one mission, one team. Guys, I'm telling you, you guys need to motivate and inspire your teams. I didn't say kiss their ass. Okay, you know why I'm yelling at you guys? Because a lot of you right now, you're capable of so much and you're so freaking talented. I'm not telling you you're not great. I'm telling you you're great and you're underplaying your responsibility as a leader. So what happens is if you guys will commit to being a leader and forget about being a car salesman, these guys will all look up to you. They'll want to be like you. They'll be unrecruitable. And then when you say, hey guys, let's self-improve and train. You know what? They'll do whatever you say because they trust you. So what do we do right now? Number one, we've got to be different than any other company in any other store. My goal is to make your team so great to make your competition look like amateurs. So what do we need to do? We got to lead from the top. Number one, everybody right now, are we the example? We need to be. And if you're not, do me a favor. Go look in the mirror, figure out what it is that is the hole in your game, the hole in yourself, and fix it. I would rather kick my own ass than have someone else come kick my ass. My goal is to know my business better than anybody else. You guys know how to retail cars, but you know how to run a sales team better than anybody else in the world. And I want to tell you, if you don't, make the decision. Everybody do me a favor. Just say this. Say, make the decision. Make the decision. Make the decision. Are you going to go and become the person you were supposed to be and make the decision to go out there and make that sales team the number one priority? Or are you going to stay the same? Whatever you do, just make a decision. I made my decision. As my company's grown through the roof. I made a decision. I'll go broke with these guys. If they're staying with me. We're all going to die together. Okay. We make it together and we take over the world. Cool. Okay. But I just want to be around the right people. Well, you guys decide instead to set the standard for what the right people look like, okay? If you got losers in your store, dude, you get what you tolerate. Why are you tolerating that shit? Get rid of them, man. Guy sells you 40 cars a month and he negs out the rest of your team? Get rid of them. You guys are great trainers, man. You guys can take anybody on the street and go, go teach them to sell 12, 15 cars. Am I right? Okay, man, what are we doing? Well, listen, if you guys will believe in me, and I mean it. I'm not asking to be your mentor, but you'll believe in me and say, you know what, Andy, you're right. Have your guys do the training, but you have to do it with them. Because in the beginning, what you will do, they'll do. If you don't do it, okay, I'm going to teach you a rule real quick. And we're at 11.13, so I said we finished at 11.14. Your team will only work half as as hard as you do. Your team will only train half as as hard as you do. Half. Which means if you want them on two training modules a day, you'll need to do four. You want them to train 10, okay? You know how it goes. Just understand this. There's a term we use in our business and it's called total recreation. Some of you guys are ready to go back and retail cars right now. You'll never have another life. You'll never have a different life. You'll never scale going vertical. You'll never be a part of it your entire life. Okay, our company will make a hundred million this year. I set your chairs, okay? Listen to me. You guys are capable of anything, okay? And by the way, you wanna see the big money come in? Build the team, build the team. You don't need to go recruit the best in the country. 
you be the best and you will make people and build them to be bad guys listen this is a leadership call so recreate change make the decision to be the best i know you guys are busy i know it's midday down there okay i think we got this recorded am i right i'll send it to you i know some of you are half listening right now because you got going on okay i'll send it to the group listen to it later take a spiral notebook pen piece of paper write this down if remember i told you this my wife said i've learned to live without you i was real close to kissing my family goodbye i went back to the store i trained my team okay then i started going home for dinner i'm going to tell you something all right most people think they can't have it all that's a lie you can have it all but you will need a team to get it all some of you guys right now are the best salespeople I've ever seen in my life. You can, matter of fact, be a sales trainer if you wanted to. But you know what? You haven't built the team yet. So what I need you to do is take some of the attention off of you, and I need you to put it on your team. And test how great you are by how fast your team can really scale and grow. And if that's your test, if that's the way you test yourself, you'll look up in six months you'll have the best team in the country, okay? So, love you guys. Go kick it. Thank you, man. We don't need to have meetings for hours. That was short, that was sweet. We'll get together, we'll have another one. You guys can ask questions, whatever you need. I know it's midday, so I'll send this recording over to you guys. Chew on this for the next 24 hours. Recreate and change. And guess what, man? Be the leader that you wish you had when you saw him, okay? Love you guys. See ya. Go kill it, man. See you guys soon. Well, you made it till the end of the video. You're a true one percenter. I've already got your next training video lined up and ready to go. Click on it. Before you do that, like the video, subscribe. Make sure you set your notifications. Every single day I drop out free, F-R-E-E, -E, free training videos for you. Click on the next video. And by the way, if you loved it, share it with a friend. Do that for me. Thank you so much. Let's kill it.